Kirby Smart's program looks for their third national championship in a four-year span. What is the most important game of the 2024 season for the Georgia Bulldogs? Hello, everyone. I'm Chris Phillips of SEC Unfiltered. Appreciate each and every single one of you tuning in. Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on notifications. Check us out via podcast wherever you get your podcast. You can also find us across all social media platforms as well as our website, secunfiltered.com. We're brought to you by our friends over at Prize Picks. Guys, download the Prize Picks app or go to prizepicks.com. And when you do, use promo code SECU for a first deposit match of up to $100. Guys, that's prizepicks.com or downloading the Prize Picks app, promo code SECU to get your first deposit match today. The Georgia Bulldogs begin their quest for their third national championship in a four-year span after falling short a season ago and being left out of the four-team college football playoff. And as we take a look at the dog schedule, and guys, I, I take you back to a time, this time last year, where people were looking at Georgia's 2023 schedule and scoffing, and chuckling, and laughing, because they felt like, and we felt like, there had not been an easier path for a national championship contender in quite some time. That is not the case with Georgia's schedule this year. There are landmines all over this thing, and there are important games, it feels like, on a week-in, week-out basis. So, as we pull up Georgia's schedule here, and of course, guys, the dogs are one of the heavy favorites, if not the heavy favorite in Vegas, to hoist the trophy. Of course, they feel like a lock for the 12-team college football playoff. But as you look at this schedule, guys, there's some really, really interesting games. And I think there's a number of directions you can go here when talking about the most important game of Georgia's 2024 season. So you look at that season opener against Clemson. Georgia should win. They're a double-digit favorite, but a tricky game, right? You look throughout the schedule. How about the world's largest outdoor cocktail party against the Florida Gators? How about that game against Tennessee later in the season that could be really interesting? Of course, at Alabama, at Texas, those games jump out. How about Auburn? A game that, again, I don't think is a game Georgia's expected to lose. I don't think it's a game they should lose, but in a rivalry matchup, Auburn nearly beat you a season ago. That could be a big one. At Kentucky to open up SEC play could be somewhat interesting, right? Especially if the Cats can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with you in regards to physicality. But realistically, guys, when you look at Georgia's schedule, right? And this is a team I feel confident in saying we haven't dropped any sort of predictions yet or anything, right? But college football playoff lock. As much a college football playoff lock as there is in the game right now, in the 12-team college football playoff. There's room to breathe, right? So Georgia, they have a more difficult schedule than they had a year ago. But the difference is we all know, guys, this year, you can drop a game. Heck, you can drop two games, and you'll still be in the college football playoff as an SEC team. So when you look at this schedule, though, guys, the two games that jump out that I think are going to be the most popular answers here of, What's Georgia's most important game? What's the what's the game to have that must-win feel in 2024? The road trips, specifically, at Alabama and at Texas. Also, by the way, guys, I don't know how I glossed over this one. At Ole Miss, a massive game for Georgia this year later in the season. You could go that direction. But where I zero in, guys, the two games that I came down to and I went back and forth on at Alabama – and at Texas, right? You've got Bama in week five. You've got Texas in week eight. Both of those will be massive games. But the game that I zero in on, guys, and I look at the most important game for the Georgia Bulldogs in the 2024 season, it is that week five road trip to Tuscaloosa. Now, that's not your SEC opener per se. You've got Kentucky a few weeks prior. And the bye week falls at a perfect time, the week before you go into Tuscaloosa. So two weeks to prepare for Kalen DeBoer and Alabama. This game, guys, for Georgia, in my opinion, is absolutely massive. And I think it is the most important game, guys, because we are going to find out 
We're going to find out. Was it an Alabama problem? Or was it a Nick Saban problem? Is it still an Alabama problem? You go on the road, night game, it's going to be a hostile environment. Bryant Denny is going to be shaking. And this is going to be the welcome to the SEC for Kalen DeBoer. But I just think for Georgia, getting this 2024 season going, right? Getting it off on the right foot. And again, you've got some games, guys, that however you feel about Alabama, whatever. There are games down the road, I could argue, will be tougher than the game in Tuscaloosa. At Texas and at Ole Miss, depending on how you feel about those teams, you could realistically argue those are going to be more difficult challenges than Alabama. Because as good as Alabama is, as talented as they are, there's going to be a lot of new moving pieces, guys. You're one of a new head coach. What's Jalen Milrow going to be? What's that offensive line going to be? What's the defense going to be replacing some big-time pieces they lost from a season ago, right? For Georgia, you're bouncing back, quote-unquote, from a 13-1 and season, but a year in which, guys, you just lost the SEC championship to the Alabama Crimson Tide. And I think it's just so important for Georgia to get that monkey off your back and to show it was a Nick Saban problem more than it was an Alabama problem. If you're going to have the kind of season you want to have and you're expected to have, which is winning the whole damn thing, if you're that team, you beat Alabama in week five. And I know it's in Tuscaloosa. It's on the road. But for Kirby Smart's program, I think they can handle the challenge, but a challenge undoubtedly. So, guys, when I look at this schedule, at Texas is a landmine. At Ole Miss is a landmine. Tennessee at home, potentially a landmine. Auburn at home, who knows? But when I look at this schedule, guys, for a Georgia team and a Georgia program that the expectations are very clear-cut, they're very simple, win the national championship, get back in that position, and establish yourself. We've been asking the question for months, Who's going to be the new Alabama? Now that Nick Saban is gone, are Kirby Smart and company ready to take over as the top dogs in college football? Week five in Tuscaloosa will tell us all we need to know. And that week five matchup against the Alabama Crimson Tide at Bryant-Denny Stadium is the most important game of Georgia's 2024 season. So, guys, when you look at Georgia's schedule, what are your thoughts? What do you think? What is the dog's most important game as UGA looks to get back to the top of the college football world? Guys, that's going to do all for me. Appreciate each and every single one of you tuning in. Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on notifications. Check us out via podcast wherever you get your podcasts. Also, guys, you can find us across all social media platforms as well as our website, secunfiltered.com. Com. Until next time, guys, I'm Chris Phillips of SEC Unfiltered. Appreciate each and every single one of you tuning in, and we'll catch you on the other side.